Welcome to Friesen's online tutorial series. My name is Catherine, and in this session, we're going to be creating a one-page template using InDesign CS4. To start, we're going to go up and select File, clicking on New Document. For our template, we want one facing page letter size, and we're going to set our margins at the top being two. The inside can be set at one or two picas if you would like some more room down your spine. Just remember to keep it consistent through your entire book. The bottom is set at four, and the outside stays at three. We're going to click on more options and we're going to add a one pica bleed line around the outside of our page. When your page comes up, you'll notice that it is already set up to be the first page in your book. It is a right hand side page. To change it to be the last page in your book, or a left-hand side page, we're going to go to Layout, Numbering and Section Options, and where it says Start Page Numbering, you can put in the last page in your book, for example, 92. Now we're all set to customize it and make it the template that we need. So we're going to go to swatches and we're going to take out all of the colors that have been created by Adobe. So we're just going to select them. And put them in the trash. The next thing we need to do is we need to go to character, which can be found on your side menu or the top menu under type. We're going to go to the flyout menu and we're going to make sure that ligatures is turned off just by clicking on it. Now we can go ahead and save our page. So we're going to go to file, save as, And we're going to save it in our school yearbook folder under templates. And we're going to label it as a one page template. And we want our save as type to be changed from document to template. This concludes our session on creating a one-page template. If you want some more options for customizing this template, you can watch our tutorial um, on a two-page customization where we added columns and we did character styles. And if you have any questions, please contact your Friesen's representative.